Welcome back to the Windows Fixer YouTube channel. Today, we are diving into a simple yet effective method to enhance your gaming experience. If you have ever faced issues with your game running at a normal priority, this tutorial will show you how to set it to high priority using the Windows registry. Now, before jumping into it, I want to emphasize that editing the registry can cause issues, so proceed with caution and consider backing it up first. Let's get started. As you can see, we just launched Valorant. If we go into the task manager, right click on Valorant and then go to details, you'll see the priority is set to normal. Now setting the priority to high manually every time is kind of a headache, so we'll make it automatic. Um, next step, close Valorant or you can just minimize it. Open registry editor. Once it's open, go to, once expanded, go to software. Just press M on your keyboard to quickly find Microsoft, then expand it. After that, find Windows NT. Press W until you get to Windows NT, expand it, then expand current version. Now, find image file execution options. Press I until you see image file execution options, then expand it. But don't go further. Just right click on image file execution options, go to new, and create a key. Rename it to the game you want to set a specific priority for. If you don't know the exact name, open task manager and you'll see it here, valorant.x. So right click on image file execution options, create a new key, and rename it to valorant.xa, then hit enter. Now we will create another key inside valorant.exa. Right click on it, new, key, and name it perf options, no spaces. Inside perf options on the right side, create a new DORD 32-bit value. Right click new, DORD 32-bit value, and rename it to CPU PRIORITYCLASS. Make sure C is capital, P is capital in priority, and C is capital in class with no spaces. Once created, double click on it, set the value to four, and click OK. Now, close everything. Currently, Valorant is still running with normal priority. To apply the changes, right click on Valorant in Task Manager and in Process Tree. This will close all Valorant related processes. Now launch Valorant again, go to Task Manager, right click on Valorant and go to Details. This time you can see it's still on Normal. If that happens, go back to Registry Editor, check the CPU Priority Class value and try changing it to 3 then click OK. Close everything related to Valorant, close the Registry Editor and restart Valorant. This time, open Task Manager, right-click on Valorant, go to Details, and now you can see it's set to High. Now, every time you launch Valorant, it will automatically run on high priority. You can also apply this to another file. Open Registry Editor, go to Image File, Execution Options, create a new key, and name it Valorant Win 64 shippingxe Make sure the spelling is correct. Then, inside it, create another key named Perf Options and follow the same steps as before. Create CPU Priority Class, set the value to 3 or 4, and click OK. Close everything. Launch Valorant again, go to Task Manager, right click on Valorant and go to Details. Now check both Valorant.exe and Valorant-Win64-Shipping.x and you will see both are running on high priority. And that's it. You have successfully set your game to run at a higher CPU priority. This can help improve performance and reduce lag while gaming. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more tips and tutorials. Don't forget to comment below if you have any questions or need further assistance. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Have a good day. Bye bye.